Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please take a moment of silence to reflect upon your day ahead. Good wonderful Wednesday morning, Margaret Mead students and staff. I'm Elias. And I'm Stuti. And we're here today with we're here today with today's headline news. Today is November 2nd, and today is the Day of the Dead, All Souls Day, Broadcast Traffic Professionals Day. Eat Smart Day, Dynamic Harmlessness Day, Be the Impact Day, International Stress Awareness Day, National Deviled Ed Day, Look for Circles Day, and it is also Cookie Monster Day. Cookie Monster have, may have first made its debut on Sesame Street in 1969, but he still continues to this day to win the hearts of people of all ages all around the world. The student ambassadors invite you to help us celebrate the fall, fall and the end of a successful first trimester with a Spirit Week. Today is Adam Sandler Day. Have you ever uh, seen any of his movies? Tomorrow is Throwback Thursday. Go retro by dressing up as your favorite decade or recreate your childhood with clothes from your own past. Don't forget about our Treats for Troops candy drive to support our veterans and deployed troops. Drop your candy off in your social studies classroom, the main office, or in the cafeteria. Tomorrow is the last day we will be collecting candy. Club Unify's next meeting will be tomorrow, November 3rd, after school in room 225. You can still join in the fun by signing a permission slip and delivering it to Mrs. Garrity or Mrs. Woods. All are welcome to join. Girls that are interested in trying out for the girls' volleyball teams must come to our informational meeting on Monday, November 14th in room 110 from 2.30 to 4 p.m. If you have any questions, please see Coach Donlin or Coach Haney. After a great win on Friday and with um, some great weather this week, we're going to play another great game of soccer on Thursdays. Um, soccer intramurals will meet once again tomorrow. Lace up your boots. Now let's shoot it over to Slocher in the Sports Corner. Hey, it's Soka here with today's sport report, sports report. The seventh grade boys basketball team beat the Keller Wildcats 49 to 30. Every player contributed to the win. Way to go, fellas. Join our seventh and eighth grade teams tomorrow in the Mustang Arena to cheer them on as they take on the Frost Spartans. Zach Levine scored 20 points in the fourth quarter last night to help lead the Bulls in their come from behind 108 to 99 victory over the Brooklyn Nets. The Phillies' five home runs assisted in their 7 to 0 win over the Astros last night. They now lead the best of seven series 2 to 1. A championship is now two wins away for Philadelphia. Tune in tonight to see if we can, if they can get one step closer to that goal. Hey, Ira, what's the weather going to be like today? Here I hear with today's weather forecast. Today is going to be another beautiful day. We started off the morning with temps in the 40s, but they will continue to climb steadily throughout the day. There will be plenty of sunshine today with highs in the low 70s. Average temps for this time of the year are in the 50s. So make sure to get out there and enjoy the nice weather we're having. Now let's send it back to Elias and Stuti at the news desk.
Today's birthday shout outs go to Miranda S. and Joey S. Happy birthday! That's all we've got for you today. Please remember to be respectful, responsible, and safe. Make it a great day, Mustangs. Bye! Bye.